Now, you know, it's just under two weeks until BBC Children in Need, when Pudsey will once again be asking you to dig deep. Throughout the week, we'll be finding out how last year's money has been spent across the region. Tonight, Sarah Farmer and Tom Hepworth have visited some of those who've benefited from your generosity. The money from BBC Children in Need funds the Saturday Club for Deaf Children's Transport. It means they can go on exciting trips and excursions on the island and on the mainland too. We take them out on trips and activities to help them to develop their language, their social skills and to give them self-confidence. BBC Children in Need have very kindly given us a grant for £3,000. It lets the children get together as a group of deaf children and to meet other deaf children living on the Isle of Wight that have the same problems and the same issues as themselves. The children love it, they really love it, and we love working with them too. You're never left out, you're always in, involved in things. How important is the Saturday Club to you? One of the most important things in my life. Thank you very much. We couldn't manage without it. It makes a huge difference to us, to the club and to the children. Family support here in Southampton does exactly what the name suggests. Many of the women who use the service have suffered domestic violence, while others have been referred by social services and other agencies. It gives the mums a bit of a break while the children have a play. I. I suffered from domestic violence and had to leave my home with a six-month-old and a four-year-old. And this was the only place I could actually come and have a break. It was the only place where I felt that I could open up. They feel isolated by the situations that they're in. They come here, they're not judged. They are part of a, a very loving, caring family. Children in need, we have a, a grant from them for 51,000, which equates to about 16,000 each year. On your journey as a mum, you do your best. Sometimes I hear it here, and that's just enough for me to be reassured and know that actually, yes, it's not perfect, but it's not that bad. You have the help you need to understand where you are and to clarify in your mind what you want. The money that you give us is a lifeline. Here at Blackbush Airfield, money from BBC Children in Need is helping air ability to teach young people with disabilities all about the world of aviation. And thanks to this project, their self-esteem is soaring. Airability works with people with all sorts of disabilities to um, make aviation accessible. Children in Need awarded us £7,700 to so be able to complete the first year of the uh, aviation education programme. The best bit about flying is um, trying to land. I'm really happy every time he goes out and goes up for a little flight somewhere. You know, he just comes back absolutely beaming. I just thought this opportunity would have never come. They're making friends, they're interacting with their mentors and it's just really nice to see them grow and develop. You just see it in their faces, the smiles, they are loving every minute of this and yeah, just keep, just keep raising your money, it's just fantastic. <laughs>